Okay, let's get it. I'm ready. I'm ready to get to the bag. They say I get to the sack so much they think I'm gay. So, that's just how I begin to the bag. See, non bag getters can't, would never understand it. Plain and simple. I hate gaming with cold hands, facts. Um, let me think here. I don't even remember where we left off. I think we're getting geodes. I got 80 of them. 79. I was rounding. <coughs> I need to talk to Robin. We gotta build another fish pond. Wait, hold up. All right, um, I need five algae, five something else, seaweed, boom. I be gaming with mittens. Anybody got gamer gloves? Me and the boys rocking gamer gloves. He popping perks off mic? No. You know when I'd be off a perk. I would say something outlandish. Like Hogwarts Legacy is the greatest game of all time. That's not even that outlandish, honestly. Hogwarts Legacy might be the greatest game this year. Given we're only two months into the year. Let's just say Hogwarts Legacy is going to be the best game until uh, comes out. That's how you gotta say it. Me and the boys when we play. Yes, sir. More ostriches. You love to see it. Pigs are kind of useless during the winter. That's what I'm really noticing. <coughs> I might need a second, uh, what's it called? Barn? What if we get an all ostrich barn? That could be something. Forspoken is game of the year. Amen. Everyone's allowed to have an opinion, even if it's dog shit. What would even be Tadatik? Nothing. Nothing is going to beat Tears of the Kingdom. You think Starfield's going to do it? Bethesda hasn't made a good game since fucking Fallout 4. Bethesda hasn't made a game since Fallout 4. Was <laughs> it Hogwarts Legacy made by the same people who made the Pixar Cars game? Shit, if it was, I might have to go play that Pixar Cars game. Because they were obviously in their bag. What the fuck? How am I missing? Stop missing! Wait, I should probably... There's a more efficient way I should have done this. I should have harvested all the ancient fruit first. And then picked up all the jelly. Whatever, it don't matter. Yes, me gamer is still coughing. I'm allergic to video games. Just want to start coughing. I actually have the black lung. If I'm being honest, I'm actually role playing as Arthur Morgan from Red Dead. Spoiler alert: He dies. All right, let's uh, get all this shit popping back in here. See, this is like the perfect harvest because everything was ready on the same day. So that made this like so much easier. Look at this. Be 
beautiful. I need more. I need more. Is the black lung why you sound black? There's no such thing as sounding black already. I've, I've talked about this before. Sounding black does not exist. You're just racist. Pixar Cars game was their prime. I don't doubt it. You know what? We'll come back later. I'm just going to talk to Robin real quick. Hey, shout out Jimbo Conundrum for the tier one sub. <coughs> so I have been thinking about it recently. And I do kind of want to stream on YouTube. Not like fully switch over, but I do want to stream once or twice on YouTube. Let's see how it is. I haven't streamed on there in a minute. Community upgrade. How much is Pam's house? 950 wood and 500k? These motherfuckers get a mansion? 500k is more than I spent on my house. They better be in a damn mansion. Last stream on YouTube was the 1.4 update? Yeah. It was the master mode shit where I was getting fucking clapped, so I just stopped streaming. Right there, perfect. I don't know if I should have put a gap in between or what, but whatever, it don't matter. Uh, let's go talk to Pam. I was gonna really build Pam a house until I saw 500, 500K. I don't think we'll be able to get to the other one. Well, we'll find out, won't we? Uh, bus stop. Hey, kid, what you up to? Making you fucking work your damn job. Holy shit, it sounds like a baby's getting murdered outside. Stale always saying some shit. Still always talking about ogres bellowing, babies murdered outside. You got an interesting life, man. I'll give it to you. Let's get some tr artifact troves. Only f how many? 15 of them. What if I got... Okay, never mind. I already lost hope just breaking that one thing. I was say, what if I broke one of these and got something I've been looking for? Alright. Let me talk to Sandy here. Sandy, do you like cactuses? Nah, she like she more of a coconut. Let's see, how did I know? You know, Casimir is smooth with the girls, but he's happily married. So, hey, what do you also sell? Bombs. Uh, ten iridium. Damn. I should have brought ten of redeem. Warp totem desert. You know, I'll be right back. All right. I'm just gonna go grab one geode. Oh, it's already 120 though. I can't. Cause you know we gotta go see Clint, and you know how Clint is. He's just waiting to close the shop. What's up? Haha, <laughs> yes, 42. How am I racist when I'm black is what he said. <laughs> uh, town. Y'all want like a garbage can hat? Wait, what the fuck? On a garbage can hat with snow on it. All right, we're doing a bet. We're doing a bet, everybody. Will I get a new artifact that I'm missing? Prediction is up. Prediction is up. I'm missing, what, two? Right? Let me check. 
We're missing one from here. And we're missing one from here. So we just need two. But when it comes to putting this in the hands of Clint, you think I'd want God or Jesus to fucking come alive and walk the world again. When we put it in Clint's hands, it might be impossible. He gave us the Elvish jewelry last time. But that's that's about it. And we had, what, 30? We had 30 last time, I think. We only have 15 this time. <clears throat> Alright, let's do it. Let's do it. It's kind of 50-50 on the vote. Kind of 50-50. I don't have high hopes. I didn't even check the luck for today. I don't care. He's giving us some interesting shit so far. I forgot that luck exists in this game. So I think next time we do this, I make sure we're as lucky as possible. Because I'm kind of tired of even trying to do this. It's just like... It's too much. Too much effort, no payout. Look, look at this. Give me the ancient seat. He gave me the ancient seat. I, I'm going to bomb this fucking place. It's a big fat no. I'm sorry, y'all. What if I restart the, the the day? Have you made the farm computer yet? I have no fucking clue. Probably not. I don't even know what to do this day, if I'm being honest. Uh, <coughs> let me go give Harvey some coffee. Harvey! Wait, hold on. Fuck you. RV, I got. There he is. Listen to his jams. Or something, I don't know. <laughs> I've never seen that room before. Harvey closes at one? What if I'm fucking dying at two? What if I'm dying on t at 2 p.m.? Did the stream crash for you guys? The stream, the stream actually is like is perfectly fine on my end. No drop frames. The colors didn't change. It's actually the first time the stream is running pretty well. So that might be a, a y'all problem if the stream was tweaking. Hey, why, why can you even get golden pumpkins? I thought these were exclusive to me completing that dumbass maze. We just giving them out. We just legit giving them out. All right, well, hold up. I'm going to make some clothes. Have I done this yet? A witch hat. For all my Hogwarts fans, my Hogwarts, uh, you can wear the top hat, all right? There. Oh my God, look at him. He looks just like me. He's gonna really run the mail industry when he's older. These are all for all my Shadow Wizard Money Gang members. We love abducting children. Something like that, I don't remember what he says. Uh, where do I put cactus? Oh, it's in here. <clears throat> uh, yeah, what was that shit? The computer? What the fuck is this? Beep boop bop. Uh, farm computer. Better pack dwarf gadget refined quartz. Better pack dwarf gadget refined quartz. Better pack. 
some some quartz. What do I keep with fine quartz? Ooh, they not they ain't that fine. Got to make them finer. Whatever, we can listen to the banging music. Hey! 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 This is where you break dance right here. Clear the floor. I'm about to get jiggy with it. <clears throat> when does uh, Tears of the Kingdom come out? Is it April? Or is it May? <sighs> That's really soon from now. That's like a couple months. I do, I do want to play Breath of the Wild again. But Breath of the Wild is a long ass game. <laughs> Breath of the Wild is a long game. How long does this take? What the fuck? Hurry the hell up. This takes way too long. Stump Brazier Wicked Statue. Wow, that's a wicked statue, bro. Whatever I never crafted. I have a jukebox. Bro, I got like a majority of the shit. Boom, craft the, the PC. Me and the boys got the PC. This thing better be the greatest PC of all time. It better be better than Ryan's. That's not hard to accomplish. Wait, no, don't put it there. Okay. Castopia Farm Analysis. Oh man, we're running out of hay. Machines ready, 25. Farm cave ready, yes. No, move it. My calendar's right there. I don't know where the fuck to put this. Where are hey, any, any birthdays? Oh, Sebastian's birthday. Did I already give him gifts though? Shit. Oh, I did it. Sebastian, Sebastian, I'm on my way. You get a frozen tear. Cry me a river, Sebastian. Don't actually. I'm coming though. Oh shit, my horse is here ready for me. Let's go. My stallion. Aha! Happy birthday. Sebastian seems lost in his thoughts. I just gave him a birthday present. Hey there, Casimir. You like coffee? Who doesn't like coffee? Come on now. She's gonna ride around the town on my horse. You know how it is. Lost in my thoughts like I'm Sebastian. Lying. I'm gonna go ride to go harvest some shit. Swagged out horse. Yeah, my horse is drowning out here. He drowning with the drip he got on. I can start playing Stardew like this. Do motherfuckers be playing like this? These be like the motherfuckers that be playing Terraria zoomed out. It's one of the comments I got today. They're like, are you fucking blind or something? Why's your game so zoomed in? Yes, I am, actually. Legally. I could probably be legally blind. If I asked, I probably could get, like, a permit or something. So, yes, I am blind. Fucking asshole. 
Let's, uh... Yeah, probably cut down these trees, right? Like, I'm not really using... Oh, wait, I need to get hay. That's what I was about to do. I have hay. Why is there always one of these motherfuckers over here? Like, some over here, y'all looking for some shit? They digging around. It's a shame Abigail's now infertile and can no longer give birth. She was only born with two eggs. God damn, why can he zoom in this much? <laughs> can the Casper Dynasty survive with only two children? Bro, I already told you that. The little Junior <clears throat> is going to carry the dynasty. That's all you need to know. Where did I put the hay at? Wait, did I put the hay in already? Oh, no, I didn't. Let me start playing Stardew like this. You cannot see shit at this angle. It's so zoomed in. I'm gonna run into something on accident. I don't even remember what the original default zoom was. This looks regular, right? <laughs> this looks regular. <clears throat> it's gotta be regular. Alright, I'm tired of these two fucking dolls in the way. Gonna put them in front of your guys' bed. But I don't think that makes it any better. They'd still be in the way. Put them down here. I would put them right there, but they can't get into their bed. I really like where Buford sleeps. Realistic. Look how much money we made. What made us our most money? The goat cheese making us a solid 2100. But obviously our carry is the fucking ancient jelly. <clears throat> yes, sir. I would never get tired of this music. I need to download this song. Play it for pre-stream. Maybe even put in some shorts. Hey, what's the point of the, this part of the kitchen over here? Look how long this part of the kitchen is, but you can't do anything with it. It's a little upsetting. Oh my god. The biggest grin just hit my face. Money, 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 money. <clears throat> Nine ancient fruit wines. Fed all the animals. Wow. I, they already get auto-fed, Abby. But I... Oh, fuck. I should have teleported. I appreciate it, I guess. That's like me being like, Hey, I made sure the, the shower would have water in it. When you take a shower, a new babe. Bye. What the? All right. <laughs> what the? Wool. Rabbit drop wool. I didn't know that. <clears throat> just pirate it on SoundCloud. Yeah, you can just probably find it on YouTube. Record it with like OBS. Bi as in short for bicycle or bisexual. Well, nobody's ever called a bicycle bi. How'd you get to work? Oh, I rode my bi. It's like, what? I bet you never said that, Stale. Silly Stale. Always saying something goofy. Oh, yeah, I took the bi to work. Car broke down, took the buy. Sound like some British slang. Stale exposing he's British. Another Brit in chat. Ostrich egg. 
I'm not gonna grow another ostrich, not yet. Not yet. <coughs> Sorry, that I'm always clearing my throat. I don't know what's up with me. I need to start drinking tea like I'm British. Here is good for your throat. Sea cucumber? I got him. We're gonna finish off uh this quest, okay? Or we're gonna finish off with Willie loving me. He's gonna Willie love me. <laughs> I need to finish make him up. What the fuck? Australians do be calling McDonald's Maccas. They call it Maccas. M A C C A S. Not Maccas. Uh, what was that doing? Sea cucumber. Do I have a sea cucumber? Probably not, right? Yeah, I didn't really expect to. What What does Willy like? Willy. Stardew. He likes catfish. He likes diamonds. Oh. Iridium. Octopus. Pumpkins. He likes pumpkins. Sturgeon. Do I even own a pumpkin anywhere? I don't think I do. So it's looking like he might be getting a diamond or an iridium bar. Oh no, I got a pumpkin. Okay, I need some more loves. We can do it in order. Willie. Evelyn. What does Evelyn love? Let's see. Diamonds. Got her. Stuffing. Do I have stuffing? Give him give them an iridium bar. Bro, I only got 68 of them. I can't afford that. We're gonna go in order of the list so I don't forget who to give shit to. Kent, he likes bombs, right? He likes shit that I don't have. Actually, no, I do have a fiddlehead risotto, don't I? Or roasted hazelnuts? I got one of them. Oh shit, never mind, it's trout soup. No, I do have a fiddlehead risotto, let's go. Demetrius Don't say it chat Don't say it Bean hot pot I got bean hot pot I I swear to god I had bean hot pot Hold up What I know for a fact That I got some bean hot pot I don't got no bean hot pot Are you kidding me what do you need to make bean hot pot? Rice pudding it is. Milk. Fuck. Kent loves bombs. What's with the Aussie slander? Ain't nobody slandering Aussies. All we just said was talking about how they said McDonald's. That's how ice cream come. Wait, now how do I not have bean hot pot though? I, like I really don't have bean hot pot is this one Do I have a strawberry at the very least like I really can't give him shit Yeah, I have nothing to give him I guess we'll just give him a diamond does he love diamonds All universal loves Pearl I'll give him a pearl any rabbit feet we're working on the rabbit feet and i gotta sell the first rabbit foot i get caroline yeah i definitely don't have no damn summer spangles i remember how hard it is to give people gifts at the beginning of the game like i was struggling early on because like what the fuck was i supposed to give people with like no inventory do i got green tea she like tropical curry 
I don't have pineapples? Fuck. Wait, I really don't have pineapples? Nobody owns no damn summer spangle. I need tea leaves. Oh my god, that just hit me that I need fucking tea saplings. Ah. <laughs> I gotta grow a whole ass tree, bro. It's all good. We could grow it on Ginger Island, but still. I, I guess we're giving out another pearl. You know what? Golden pumpkin. That's a universal love. I'm about to look at golden pumpkin stardew. Is there any other uses for a golden pumpkin? That's about it. <laughs> it's just a universally loved gift. Anybody else that's like super close? Marnie, I guess, is super close. She likes diamonds. Do I have anything else? Yeah, I guess diamonds it is for her, too. Um, and then the wizard. We know what the wizard loves, right? He loves, like, mushrooms and shit. Essence. You get some mushroom. Why not? The music wasn't going crazy. I remember I installed the mod to Cuck Pierre. Interesting. As a cutscene where Pierre cons confronts Caroline about ever gonna be his kid. Yeah, I think that's. I seen a video about that. Like, I didn't watch the whole video, but like, I I kept on seeing it when I was playing Stardew early on. It was like Pierre is not her kid or whatever the fuck. Abigail isn't Pierre's kid. Um, what am I giving this motherfucker? A pumpkin? This is great. If only me old puppy was around. Yeah, I already called a rare fish. Oh, this is going to be awkward. Yeah, those are perfect. Yep. Go ahead, Pastor. Yep. Alright, who's next? Evelyn. Snow yam. Hey, you actually. Evelyn. You in here? Oh my god, more cutscenes. Okay, George, I want you to take a deep breath for me. <laughs> mm -hmm. Turn around, please. George, I'll be honest with you. You need to make some changes in your lifestyle if you want to stay healthy. Bro, he's like 80. I'd like you to reduce your sodium intake and try to get some moderate exercises with your arms. He said, motherfucker, I'm 80. I know what's best for me. Who do you think you are telling me how to live my life? Harvey's gonna tell him to start walking. He said, George, you need to walk around more. I mean, Dr. George, that's who I am. And I went to school for eight years so I could learn how to help people stay healthy. Help these, and I'm gonna just punch him in his face. Oh, I'm sorry, but you shouldn't be here. These checkups are supposed to be private. Shut up. I run the fucking town. Not so fast. I'd like to get a second option or opinion from this young man. See? What I tell you? I run the town. Kesper, what do you think George should do? Um, well, I want the friend point, so I'm going to Google that right answer. I'm assuming this is a Harvey quest. I don't know. The top one.
Thanks, Casimir. You see, George, I'm just trying to help you. Yeah, George, quit being fucking stubborn before I push you into the river. You're already pushing 80. Let's let's get to 85. Let's get to 85. I actually don't know how old George is. I know he's old. Where I, is George really not like that high up with me? The fuck? Evelyn, I am here with diamonds. That's what you like, right? I don't know. I'm just, I gotta make sure. Second checking. Oh. Yes, sir. Diamonds. You're welcome. You made an old lady very happy. I'll be baking cookies today. Maybe I'll tell you what my recipe one of these days, please. I need all the recipes. Hello, Casimir. Want to watch TV with me? See, George is such a nice guy to me now. George is really my guy now. Is Kent on the island? Kent's on the island, isn't he? Yeah. Uh, so let's move the fiddlehead. Who's after Kent? Let me just make sure that Kent was the fiddlehead, right? Yeah, he was. Okay. We don't know George's full age, but he's over 55. He definitely... I can tell you he's over 55. I can easily tell you he's over 55. <laughs> yeah, I knew that one. You didn't have to tell me. Alright, Demetrius is getting a pearl. He pushing, he gotta be pushing like 70, 80. Cause he looks crusty. What a damn rusty sp Oh my god. All these damn cutscenes. He got a bike? Can I ride that shit? Oh, hello, Casimir. What, you haven't seen my motorcycle before? Hmm, I guess I haven't shown it to you. I don't even know a fucking neat twink like you fucking <laughs> rides around on a motorcycle. Sometimes, what happened to the color? What's going on? Sometimes after sundown, I make the long ride out of Stardew Valley. There's nothing else like it. Blazing along the empty stretch of road toward the faint city glow. Once I saved up enough money, I'm going to head out on my own to the city and beyond. Just me and my bike. The hell? He pissed himself? There we go. Oils change. You only get to ride the bike when you become his partner? I'm about to divorce. I'd be able to ride the bike. Hey, maybe I'll let you ride sometime if you want. Hey, yo. What you talking about, Seb? What am I riding? I'm interested no matter what, though. None of the choices affect his relationship. That sounds fun. Great. Raja Rabbit. See, that's a name I haven't heard in forever. What the? Why did it kick me off of my horse? Hey, Demi, you in here? Demi, my boy. I got you. Diamonds and pearls, you know what I'm saying? Do you have any animals on my farm? That's it. He didn't actually want to talk to me. Ask me a question. I didn't even get to answer it. Alright. Um, Caroline and Marnie. Caroline's gonna gold. I think. I don't know, actually. <laughs> wait, wait, what the fuck was I gonna get Marnie? Did I not pick up another diamond? This is going to Kent. This is going to the wizard. I think I was supposed to pick up another diamond and I just forgot. Whatever this one. Terraria Kahoot win. Uh, I gotta set up the Kahoot. It's not gonna be just Terraria. It's definitely not just gonna be Terraria. Game Raiders Kahoot, though. I will look into it probably tonight. Maybe we'll do it this weekend. Yeah. 
We're off. To the islands. Oh, I forgot to give this shit to the wizard. Whatever, it don't matter. We'll see him eventually. Kent! Kent! Where are you? Kent! Where the fuck's Kent? Wait, he's not here on the island with his family? That's how you know he's a fucking weirdo. How your whole family go to an island vacation? You're not there. What was that? Something had a plus. Poppy. All right. Once I see one of everything sold. Okay. That's when I will come back here and start planting everything. Once I see one of everything has been sold. Sure, sell these ribs too. What am I gonna buy? You know what I'm saying? Sell these ribs too. Okay. Looking good here. There ain't really much for me to see here. I don't know where the fuck Kent is. Don't be Kent. Don't Kent stand at the river? Ah. He, he could always get a gift later. I got shit I need to do. Like talk to the wizard, for example. Very important. Kent be drowning. Kent face down in the river fucking drowning. Hey, you think Barney's open? What am I stuck on? Nah, I can still reach this. Uh, Grim, by the way, if you're wondering. I knew I wasn't that stupid. We'll call the horse in a second. Call the horse right here. She just, she just like got up to start moving. You like yams? You like yams? Uh, they probably don't like yams. Uh, you like fish eggs? Welcome. You like yams? Uh, my bad. Miss Penny's teaching me how to write in cursive. Writing in cursive is the most useless thing ever. Name something useful for writing shit in cursive other than your signature. And even your signature can just be made up fucking lines that you draw. My signature is literally D. Actually, I don't know. It's just the letter D. And then I draw a pentagram around it. Okay, I'm lying. That's not my signature. <laughs> D-I-C-K is my signature, but in cursive. <laughs> cursive is a dead language. Cursive ain't even a fucking language. Cursive is a waste of time what you meant to say no point in learning how to write something fancy oh my god guys look I can write it cursive <laughs> I love the noises of picking shit up from here Yeah, we'll wait for wine. We will wait for wine. Get to work, Robin. Get to work. Need to see more swings. What's a snow yam carrot look like the bunny mount from the angler? That is just a carrot shape, bro. You need to you need to hop out of the Terraria universe and see things. Normally. Hey, there's Kent. Sam has really grown up since I left. He's a man now. You want some risotto? Oh, mom used to give me this when I was a young boy. Brings back wonderful memories. Thank you. 
What about a bomb? What kind of memories does that bring? Just asking. I'm not going to give him a bomb or anything, but I'm just wondering. Fuck that. Remember the good old days when the JoJo Mart existed? Yeah, I don't. JoJo Mart was too fucking far away for me to even care about it. Doom, doom. Doom, doom. Doom, doom. Remember when I bombed the Joja Mart? Good times. I mean, they don't really teach cursing nowadays. How do you know? How do you know? I learned cursive in like first grade. You a fucking first grader? Do you have memories of first grade that are recent? How do you know? Why did I? The day is in your hands. Of course it is. The one day. I don't care. You know what? It might be one of those days again. You know what I'm saying? One of them grind days in the the shafts, huh? Wait, I didn't even check how much that wine made us. I speak about wine. This is what I like to see. Will this wine be done by the end of the playthrough? I don't know. <laughs> wine does take a long time to ferment or whatever the fuck wine does one oh one that's a game raiders reference if you guys didn't know I am going to do nothing because Pam isn't here can't do shit until Pam's at the bus. You like that? Gotta pet the blue chickens and the dinosaurs. These are the only dudes I pet. I'm about to spawn in that auto petter. Fuck it. I'm tired of petting things. Ostrich is the only thing getting petted. Two milk. Like sometimes I wonder why do I even own them damn animals. milk like I should just replace them with ostriches at this point but that's the thing I was talking about like should I make another barn fill it up with cows so that you know we actually produce some dairy product because I got all these dairy machines but no dairy product some point I am running low on hay Buford you can't go that way silly dog you know I, I probably should have talked to uh, Marnie before I came over here I hope to god that fucking what's her face is working there you go. 
How long have I been streaming? We're about to hit an hour. Honestly, I might end off after this day. Did you know that Gus loves diamonds? It would make a great gift. Oh, does he now? Who would have thought that somebody loves diamonds? Do you guys know that? That there's somebody in the world that loves diamonds as a gift? I bet you guys didn't know that. I'm gonna go give Sandy a feather. I don't really care what she actually likes. I'm gonna just give her random shit until she's at like two hearts. Welcome. Cactus. Diamonds from Minecraft? You know they exist like IRL too, right? Carrots aren't just from Terraria and diamonds aren't just from Minecraft. Just in case you didn't know. Tattoo if you like men. You know what's wild is that Flash movie still coming out. Like Ezra Miller was doing terrorist acts and they're still dropping a Flash movie with him. <laughs> acts of terrorism. He was terrorizing the whole state of Hawaii. And I'm still going to watch that Flash movie. It look amazing. They kind of have to. No, they don't have to do shit. We've seen shit get ended immediately for lighter things. Seen whole fucking actors just get their whole shit removed for a tweet. Shit, James Gunn got fucking kicked off of Disney temporarily for old ass tweets they weren't even that bad and everybody realized that James Gunn's a fucking genius my favorite Ezra Miller videos were that one dude's recording him and then he's just like talking he's like <laughs> he's like you want me to beat your ass right now and then the dude recording is like yeah wait no no <laughs> And Ezra Miller is like dead serious. He's like, just say the word and I'll, I'll punch you right in your face. <laughs> He's like, wait, 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 wait. Classic Ezra Miller. Movie looks good, horrible guy. Yeah, the movie looks cool. People were saying this is uh, DC's end game or DC's no way home. But I'm pretty sure DC been doing shit longer than Marvel, but you know how it is. And that's me being a Marvel fan before I'm a DC fan. But DC is the OG. They suck on the movie side, though. We can't lie about that. Maybe, like, four good DC movies. If we're talking about, like, actual DCU, too, and not, like, Christian Bale's Batmans. They only got, like, one good movie, maybe two. Maybe, like, three average ones. They've been a lot better though recently. But like their best movie is literally made by James Gunn. Don't worry, James Gunn will flip the whole universe upside down to make it good. What's the best movie y'all have seen? Endgame. Endgame will be my top movie all time just because of how much build up there was to it. Let's just say I've never felt the way watching a movie that I have Endgame. And that's even having it spoiled that 
Iron Man was gonna die. I think I was just on like a random post on Instagram and I, I wanted to see the comments and then somebody just spoiled Endgame in it. But like I knew Iron Man was gonna die. Like so somebody was gonna die. And it was either Cap or Iron Man. It ended up pretty much being both of them. So like it wasn't that big of a spoiler, but like the way the movie played out was so far. Like, I was straight up crying tears of joy when everybody came back through the portals. I still, to this day, have not watched Endgame again. It's because I keep saying I want to watch Endgame and Infinity War back to back. Just to have, like, a the true, like, experience. That scene where everybody came back through the portals in Endgame, that shit legit had me crying tears of joy. I ain't never felt that way watching a movie. The thing is, like, it's going to be hard to top the experience of watching in a theater because, like, nothing beats watching, like, a movie in a theater. That is literally, like, the best experience to watch movies in a theater with other people, live reactions and your reaction at the same time. Like, when fucking Cap picked up Mjolnir, bro, the whole theater was like, what? What the fuck? Everyone was going crazy in the theater. Same thing with No Way Home. When fucking Andrew Garfield Spider-Man popped up. I was so confused at first. Like, we need to find Peter. And then he's just in an alleyway. And in my head, I was like, what the fuck is this dude doing in an alleyway? And then some people in the crowd started getting loud. And I was like, hold up. Hold up. Is this who I think it is? And then everything starts to click. And then Andrew, he pops through the portal. Yeah, everyone started going crazy. This shit was amazing. <laughs> the thing is, like, if you're like a just like a above average MCU fan, like you, you already know like what's gonna happen. You can predict it. Like I've been predicting so much shit in the MCU. <laughs> But even when it does happen, it's still, like, shocking. Like, that one trailer that came out for No Way Home where uh, Lizard got punched by air. Like, that sealed the deal. Like, yeah, the other Spider-Mans are in this movie for sure. That one fucking trailer where nothing hits the Lizard, but he still gets punched by something. I was like, alright, yeah, come on now. <laughs> Come on now, there's some other motherfuckers in this scene and you guys aren't showing them. They did that shit on purpose. I ain't gonna lie, that movie had me shedding tears. I watched that bitch like five times. That shit had me shedding some, dropping some tears. That fucking scene where all three of them come together and talk about Uncle Ben. Right after Aunt May died, bruh. That might be like legit one of the saddest scenes in the MCU. I was tearing up in the theater. I guess eat this. I don't know how good this is. Okay, it's fine. The fight scene with Goblin and Peter. Yo, Green Goblin was getting his shit in, bro. He was fucking, <laughs> he was fucking Spider Man up. Oh. He body slammed him through like three hours. I said, damn. <coughs> Yeah. 
This is how I kill mummies. When I don't have a crusader weapon. It's only 8 p.m. I feel like I've been down here for a minute. Does explosive ammo kill them? We tried it on them. I don't think it was doing anything. Which is weird. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Let's see. Next time we see something. We'll try when they're dead. I don't think I tried it when they were dead. Honestly, I just remembered that explosions killed them a second ago. Wow. Blew all that shit up for that one stone. And hey, we're getting a lot of stone. I remember I needed a lot of stone for something. What's up, big bitch? Oh, a dinosaur egg. Remember when I spent like two, three streams looking for a dinosaur egg? I combined all the streams in one video on the channel. I might actually edit another Stardew video for tomorrow. Just to, you know, catch up the anime watchers with the, the manga. I know the anime only fans a little behind on the uh, Stardew. Ah, nice. So that's a, that's a cool little way you could kill them. It's not like explosive ammo is hard to get either. It's only like a couple hundred for like five or ten. That's how I'm going to sound when I die. Oh. <laughs> we watched Start the Video on Lunch Break Shammy laughing. It's a good series if you watch the whole series. Clicker class better though. Actually, I haven't watched Clicker Class past that, like, first three episodes. But I remember I watched it, the Clicker Class, like, the first couple episodes of Clicker Class right before I was about to sleep. They should have me dying in the bed. I said, <laughs> so I knew this one dude in ceramics. One of my homies in a ceramics class came to school <laughs> after he got hit by a car. That fucking story. <laughs> Had me die. That shit was so funny. I'm like, you got hit by a car. <laughs> what the fuck? Why the hell did you come to school? It's funny because he would bike to school. So I think his bike was like completely fucked up. <laughs> I know an ambulance is expensive, but like, we're pretty close to a hospital school is for play balloon tower defense no Maybe like back in the day back in my day I was playing BTD on armor games or addicting games you know what I'm saying new grounds it's them OG days right there Smith this OG. Just kidding. Hospital too expensive. Just walk it, walk it off. Well, you had to go to the hospital eventually to get a fucking brace. So it did not matter either way. Money was not going to be saved. Walk it off. Like something a fucking baseball coach should tell you. You'd be like walking around with a broken leg and walk it off. 
Uh, okay, hold on. How are we gonna do this here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know it's fucking late. Calm down. Doing shit. Important shit here, okay? Make your money. Time is money. And I got money on my mind. What time do you pass out at? Two? Probably should get a move on then. <laughs> it's, getting a little, it's getting a little close. Wheel Terraria coming back? Probably not ever. Too uh, expensive, my executive told me. No, I'll play one more day because I'm feeling like playing one more day. I watched the full Project Zombie stream because the highlights were so funny. Project Zombie is cool. I don't know if I'll ever get into it into it because it's kind of hard. <clears throat> there's some uh, there's some gamer that bangers scattered amongst the channel, hidden gems. Spirits feel neutral today. I don't know how I feel about that. I'm just gonna save the gems, okay? Or geodes. I'm just gonna save the geodes until uh, later. <laughs> Go ahead and store everything here. this shit, excuse me, toss this shit here, why does Kent want even more shit, like Kent, bro, why can't you just be satisfied in life, why do you need more, like I can't even get, oh no, there you go, Wizard is gonna get another mushroom. Uh, Demetrius, motherfucker, I really gotta give this dude somebody else. Demetrius, you'll get a, actually, you don't even like diamonds, does he? Alright, you'll get another pearl, I guess. This will be the last day I'll play, alright. Dear Kazma, I heard too much fertilizer. Wow, that's not even fertilizer, Jody, but I appreciate it. Basic retaining soil. Classic fertilizer. I don't know if I ever told this story about, uh... What the fuck? I don't know if I ever told this story. I remember in PE this one time. I straight up rolled my ankle. I'm talking about like a day later during the weekend. I rolled it on a Friday during PE. And um, I rolled my ankle. It was Friday. And I remember I rolled that shit. And then I looked at my PE teacher who saw me roll it. Literally made eye contact with me as I rolled my ankle. And the motherfucker just ignored me. And I was limping like the whole rest of the day at PE. And I got all motherfuckers on my team. We're, this was during like a championship game that we won. I think we were doing like ultimate frisbee championship. And then uh, everyone's like, you okay? You good? I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just rolled my ankle. PE teacher looked directly at me. Saw me roll my ankle. Saw everything. This motherfucker doesn't come out to me and ask me anything. He don't hit me with it. You okay? You good? Now he looks at me and then just continues like walking around. Like I didn't just bust my shit. I was like, bro, there's no way. So I'm limping around the whole day. The rest of the PE period. This motherfucker doesn't ask me a single question. 
Like, there's no way. He's just ignoring me. <laughs> I'm a big boy. I'll, I'll walk it off. But, like, yeah, literally the next day, it was the weekend. So, thank God I didn't have to go to school. But it was the weekend. And my fucking ankle was so swollen, bro. Shit was swollen. Okay, we gotta put fish in here. I don't know what fish, but we gotta put something in there. My shit was busted up. Until this day, I still remember that. I still remember that my PE teacher did not give a shit. <laughs> It was funny. It, w it was pretty funny. I won't lie to you. Just thinking about it. I remember somebody broke their fucking hand playing tag in PE. That shit was like the funniest story ever. Because it was like this one kid. He tripped. And he landed on his hand. And he was fine at first. But then a bigger dude. That was chasing him during tag. Fell on top of him after he tripped. And it broke his wrist. And I remember. They were saying how scared he was. <laughs> He was panicking that he broke somebody's wrist. <laughs> Kent, my guy. Are we like at our top happiness now? I hope so. And Demetrius is who else I'm going to give shit to. A lot of people walking around. Kind of weird. I think you break your hand in tag. I just let you know. Very interesting. He said Boulder from Terry fell on his ass. No, don't hop back on that. Demi, he's actually in here. What's up, Demi? You, we better, we better be, you know, homies now. You better be topped. There's no fucking way. That's insane to me. What house renovations can I do? I could close the bedroom. This is interesting. I don't even know where the bedroom is. <laughs> My bedroom's in the top right. But what is the bedroom according to her? That's 200000 for that? That's actually... That wouldn't hurt my pockets. Pockets would be fine after that, if we're being honest. Remember in elementary school, someone broke their arms doing monkey bars. Damn. Silly fella. Fart smeller. Alright. Uh, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. You know what, I think it's about time we just get like 10, 10 of, wait, how much do we need to sell? What's, what's the thing? 15 of each crop, ugh. ugh. Take the holly, I don't want it. Holly jolly Christmas, okay. I need it. Oh my god, this is so much. I don't even want to do this. <laughs> I don't even want to do this. 15 of each crop? I'm going to pull my hair out. I just pulled a piece of my hair out, actually. I'm balding. No, I'm not actually. Uh, let's see here. 15 of each. Jesus, this is going to take a fucking long time to do this.
The thing is, I probably sold a bunch of things 15 times already. But I'm too lazy to check, so, you know, why not we just sell 15 more things? You know what I'm saying? Besides wheat. You know what, fuck it. Grow the wheat, too. It don't matter. I've definitely sold blueberries. And I probably definitely sold melons. That's all I'm taking for now. Wait, I can't sell you this? You know what? Eat it. Eat it and buy something else. Okay. We're going to run home. We're going to grab uh, sprinklers. Zombie train. Look at that. You saw how straight of a line they're in. They're playing COD zombies. When I was a kid, I went on monkey bars and I instantly felt an insane searing pain in my arms that fell off. I remember there was like a test we were doing as kids. I'm talking about like second grade, third grade. And it was like a PE test. And you had to like hang on this bar for a long time. Or just, they were just seeing how long you can hang on this bar. And I remember I was hanging from the bar and I was fucking shaking after like 10 seconds. And motherfuckers were laughing at me. I felt so embarrassed as a kid. I was like, why is everyone laughing at me? I'm a fucking second grader. Of course I can't hold on to this bar. And then like the next person that went up and did the exact same thing and I was laughing at them. <laughs> I got my revenge laughing. I said, ha, you also a little ass kid too. Good try holding onto that bar. Hey, can I give Leo something else? Where is Leo at? I gave him two things. Right? Any more original sprinklers? Which I need a lot of space for. batteries uh six should be fine there's no way i need more than six right i hope any more seeds i can bring i got an extra spot tell me now or forever hold your peace all right here you go I got a lot of PE stories. All my PE stories are funny. I remember this is one game in like six, no, seventh. It was seventh or eighth grade that we played in PE. And it was called Australian Pursuit. It's where you just run in a circle. There's four cones. And like two teams start on the opposite side of each other. And you just run in a circle. And one team has to tag the other team on the other side. Of the circle. So you're just running around in a circle. One team here. One team here. You start running. Clockwise direction. And the goal is for one team to tag the other team. And I remember it was so like. What's the word? It was so like. Uh, nerve wracking. Because we did it in the gym. And it would usually be like multiple gym classes participating. So, like, it felt like a fucking basketball game was going on. You know, like, the shit was crowded. Everyone was watching. That shit was nerve-wracking. A lot was on the line. And then, uh... So, we had to run in a circle. My mind was full as fuck. We had to run in a circle. Tag the other team. And when it got to me and my team... I was nervous as shit. But then uh, <laughs> it was my turn to go. <clears throat> and then the dude that was on the other team, literally like the first five seconds, he ran, tripped on his own foot and fucking face planted. And then like I got a free tag out of it. <laughs> That's all I remember. I got a free tag out of that bitch. 
And I was like, yes, sir. Easy W. It counted in everything. I was like, man, that was easy. I could have did that. I could do it again. Run it back. Just kidding. We didn't run it back. Because we won. We didn't have to run it back. Yeah, that shit was funny as fuck when that happened. Planning bok choy down. We planning eggplant down. Can I? Okay, we're good. We're good. Not like the most efficient use of space. Probably could have been way more efficient. Hey, shout out anonymous for gifting it a sub to cool guy. Shout out Anonymous, what a great person. What an anonym, anonymously cool person they are. Let's do corn, I'm gonna do pumpkins later. Ah, uh, okay, now here's the question, where do we go from here? Like here? Think should work? What the fuck? What, Stardew, if you don't stop doing that shit. So I can't plant there. I can plant here. You see, like I said, it's not going to be the most efficient use of space, but... <laughs> what can I do sometimes? We're going to have, like, a couple extra spots right here. Same shit's going to happen right here. We're not going to have the most efficient space, but whatever. The goal is just to get this shit grown... Sell 15 of each. Go from there. And like I said, I probably have sold 15 of each of a majority of these. <clears throat> Thank God it's raining though, so I don't got to water shit. Wait, six months of tier one sub? <laughs> I didn't even notice that. Shout out Anonymous even more. Six months? <laughs> Not just like a gifted sub for one month. Six months? Somebody just blessed cool guy. Maybe it was himself that blessed him. He said, let me bless myself. definitely happen I've seen it okay I want to get full potential from this one so I'm gonna plan it like down here a shout out anonymous for gifting six months sub to guck flim six months of a tier one sub to guck flim Another six months. <laughs> Enjoy those six months. It's going to be a great six months. Oh my god, another six months to Slicicle? Whoever this anonymous gifter is, bro, he's blessing the chat right now. He blessing the chat. Make sure y'all say thank you. Thank you, Anonymous Gifter, for blessing. Salute. Give me some creepy ass noises to start you. <laughs> Stop. 
Those noises make me shiver my timbers. But I'm really focused. I would say more about the gifting and read chat more right now, but I'm really focused, alright? I'm a farmer. I'm a money maker. I'm focused on getting this cash. Give me a second. Cranberries. Alright, we're not done yet here. I need to get some fences down. Let's do that. That's more important than anything else. Get the fences down to protect shit. Holy shit, my inventory's full. That should be more than enough fences. I love this noise. This is gonna be the only way in and out right here. A little bit more, a little bit more, one more tree. Cause I need to get that one area. All right, let's get two more trees. You work fast here. There's no way more subs are being gifted. What's going on right now? All right, let me pause. Let me pause. So we just saw like 18 months of subs worth of gifts. Did I say that right? We just saw 18 months worth of gifted subs from an anonymous gifter. And now we got Slicicle paying forward the gift from the anonymous gifter to kill a cam? Shout out, shout out y'all. Shout out y'all gifting subs, giving each other subs. Good guys in the chat. See, this is why I don't want to leave Twitch though. But Twitch is pushing streamers away every day. I'm pretty sure it has officially gone through that Twitch streamers are gonna get less money now. Great, love to hear it, right? <laughs> if you guys didn't know wait I didn't harvest this let me harvest this oh I don't have room yeah the main reason why I want to switch to YouTube now. YouTube is a lot better. They've gotten a lot better. They caught up to Twitch. But the main reason I don't want to switch just like fully over is because like my the Twitch, I always considered like my Twitch paycheck as like an extra. It's separate from my YouTube paycheck. You know, it's like an extra paycheck that came in. So I always consider, consider Twitch like a side job. Like a side hustle. Wow, I did not sell anything. Either. We're going to play some extra days because you guys are gifting subs and shit. That's always my promise is I'll play extra days. When the gifts start coming out. But yeah. It's like, I, it's all the money goes into the same area. And YouTube, you already get paid once a month. So think about that. I have to budget myself with one paycheck throughout a whole month. And if I ever want to buy something for myself, like shoes or clothes, or say if I need to upgrade like a PC part, you know, money gets scarce. Shit gets scarce with one paycheck a month. Whether the paycheck is big or not, and with the recent views and shit and how the channel's been going, you know it has not been big. Like, I, I was fearful of being able to barely get through one of these months. The, the, the fucking paycheck was going to be barely able to cover rent. Thank God I don't own a car or some shit, right? Thank God I don't drive. Imagine if I, like, drove or had anything else I needed to pay besides rent. 
I do. I gotta pay internet and shit like that, but it's fine. But yeah, that's the other thing. I always like that the the check was separate on Twitch. And shout out just kid for subscribing. But then again, like I said, YouTube is just better nowadays. Ever since Twitch went through with the fucking even less money for their content creators, the one thing that keeps Twitch alive is crazy to me. That they would give less money to the people that keep this shit alive. You know how it is. Shout out to everybody in here, though. Even if you're not a sub, if you're gifting a sub, shout out. It don't matter. As long as you guys are just here. That honestly is fine. It's just kid, the anonymous gifter. We're trying to theory craft the anonymous gifter. Who is it? And we might fuck around and let's, what's the sub count looking like? 27? Oh shit, he's giving out more. The Anonymous Gifter is blessing out more. Shout out, the Anonymous Gifter. Another six months to Legend Knight. Six months is crazy. What's today? Sunday? So I can re gift people shit? Uh, okay. Um, let me see here. Let, let's just finish planning all this for now. So this is why it's good to always buy sprinklers from like Krobus. So you don't have to worry about all this. Not again. He gifted out more stuff. Just kid. Not anonymous anymore. Look, we cracked the code. We cracked the code. Just kid. Hey, shout out Just Kid, man. Gifting another six months of six months worth of subs to 8 Cam. We cracked the code. What if there were two gifters? Nah, I don't know. Um, hello. Sorry, I'm not good at writing letters. I made one middle bar too many. Wow, thanks, Clint. <laughs> Starting tomorrow, traveling merchant fleet. Yes, sir. The night market, my favorite event. All right, I'm going straight to the islands today. I ain't got no time to fuck around. Messed up. He said he messed up. And we were kind of, we were getting on to you. We were getting on to you, though. People were cracking it. The theory started coming out. into the sound of the waves hey quit fishing you got somewhere to bring me bro quit fishing can I eat a gold bar <clears throat> what oh shoot are we finally gonna bring Leo home I've been waiting for this I'm adopting a kid no Linus is Linus, stay away from him. Whoa. He speaks bird? That's wild. <laughs> you know he speaks English too, right? Hello, Leo. My name's Linus. Is this like his lost kid or some shit? I heard all about you and your parrot family. It's really something special. Aye, lad. Linus lives on the mainland with the rest of us. After hearing your story, I wanted help, so I talked to Linus here and hatched a little plan. We are kidnapping you. Abducting you. Go on, Linus. Tell him. Leo. I'd like you to come back with us to Stardew Valley. It's a beautiful place. Not as warm as here, but still full of life. And I live right in the middle of it. You live at the top of the mountain in a tiny tent. I know the lay of the land and many things about the waters and the trees, the animals, and more. 
You see, I'm a child of nature too. You might say we're birds of a feather. But I'm getting old and I'd like to teach someone all that I've learned before moving on. Leo, will you come back with us? We're not giving you a choice, Leo. L leave the island? I can take you back for a visit anytime, but lad, you can't live here forever. You know there are other children back home too, I'm sure they'd love to meet you. Other kids? Yeah, we abducted other kids. <laughs> what do you think, Casimir? You know it's Cash Money Casimir. It's up to Leo, bro. It's up to Leo, if we're being honest. I, I'll go. Yes, sir. Linus homeless tips. But my family. Brother birds. They can just fly to us. Just one bird. They weren't really your family. Only one of them fucked with you. She says, there's a bomb in the ship. She says, the parents are all happy for me. And that they want me to start the next chapter of my life wherever it may lead. She did not say all that. And no matter what happens, it'll always be my family forever. She ain't say all that. She fucking chirped twice. Liar. I'm ready. You yeah, don't got much to bring anyways. Don't worry about packing anything up. A new arrival to the valley. Seems our little town is growing. Hey, how come y'all ain't say that shit when my kids were born? Leo is no longer here. Birds of a feather fuck together somewhere like that. Alright. Can't Leo just fly using the birds? Yeah, probably. I'll be using the birds to fly. Hey, I'll just kid giving six more subs, months worth of subs to Stellar Star Fall. How you affording all this shit? He robbed a bank. I know because I was there. I helped him. What's like the best way to water all this? I like guess. This one. There you go. So I kind of wish it turned into a bigger square. I only have so much fertilizer and stuff. Let's get what we can out here. Just Kid giving even more subs out. This is crazy. Just Kid. Another. Six months of sub to live, Mr. Mister. He's hiding for the police right now, trying to get rid of the money. See, that's a good way to get rid of it. Honestly, a genius way to get rid of it is how they're gonna get it back. They're not gonna take my subs away. I'm really about to be an accomplice. Mr. Game Raiders 101. Seems that somebody in your chat has been gifting subs illegally. So I don't know what you're talking about. Officer, I have no clue what you're talking about. 
All my subs were gained legally, okay? Ain't no illegal activities out here. Only half of my subs were gained illegally. Only half. The other half were gained completely fair and square. Don't worry, I'll be your defense attorney. Oh, we going to jail for sure. Y'all get ready. Pack it up. Pack it up, y'all. Oh, fuck. I don't have enough. <laughs> I don't have enough. Uh. A shout out. Just get gifted even more subs. Anybody that talks that doesn't have a sub is getting a fucking sub, as you can see. Bad day to be a lurker. How long do yams take? Ten days? I'll be right back. Let me go get more shit. While I'm here, I might as well do a quick harvest. I need more barrels. I just noticed that. Like, I really need more barrels. We're getting to the point where we have so much ancient fruit. And we have no barrels to put them in. Wait, can I even get back here? No, I can't, can I? Ah, fuck. Ah, shit. Alright, don't worry about it, man. Is anyone not a sub now? Yeah, there's probably... There's probably like 20 people watching around 20. Somebody hasn't spoken. I was gonna strip this stream. Glad I didn't. You didn't have to hurt my feelings. He said a gamer. God damn! What the fuck? He just gifted the whole fucking... Stream and then previous stream. Hey, shout out Just Kid for gifting. I don't even know how many 20 tier one subs. I had to sit up. I had to sit up. There ain't even 20 people in this stream. <laughs> There's only 17 people. Hold up, we gotta get a round of applause playing. Okay, crowd clapping sound effect because apparently, round of applause. Here we go. Put your hands together for Just Kid. Let's get some fireworks. Sound like gunshots. I need better fireworks. Damn! I'm taking fire! We're just gonna hear the kiss. I need to change that sound effect. <laughs> I don't know what I'd change the sound effect to, but I need to change that eventually. Don't play that around Clint. You mean Kent? Sorry, now nah, you good. I just wanna. I don't know why it's on the creeper sound effect. I had PTSD with that. My bad, my bad, my bad. I like how the Stardew music like ended once I started playing. The clapping and shit. Even the game knew. Alright, let's set this up here, okay? Let's get this nice and set up here. We don't want any weeds, as they're called. I could break that. Right? Don't want no weeds attacking any of my plants. Now we know what Just Kids local bank sounds like. 
He was raining the bank. Firing shots off in the bank. Shots fired! Alright, there you go. Set up. Boom. Might need to put like a scarecrow down or two, but you know what? I don't care. <laughs> I'm going to place the garlic down since this only takes four days to grow, so I'm not too worried about that. But there you go. That That's what I'm doing for now. I'm leaving all this shit like this. It'll get done eventually, okay? Just you know we got, a, we got a nice work in progress going on. We know Guck going to jail and sleep if he tries to commit a crime. Who the fuck robs a bank in a town they live in? Damn. Why you got so many tips about robbing a bank? Is it over? No, it's still going. I think it's the last one. The last one. Jaguar gets the last one. No, I lied. One more. Now it's the last one. Here we go. Shout out Just Kid again. If y'all got a sub, make sure you thank him. See, this is why it's always better to be a stream viewer rather than a regular content viewer. And then if you're neither of them, you don't get to experience things like this. Like, I'm about to turn on my face cam and start twerking. Alright, no, I'm lying, I'm lying. But imagine if you just didn't come to streams and you didn't watch the videos. Like, you would never even... I could have done it and you wouldn't even know. You wouldn't even know. He said, ah, oh, come on. <laughs> he said, boo. You, I thought you were really about to do it. Preserves jar. That's what I need wood and stone for. Okay. How many subs to start twerking? A thousand. Gotta go have a good night. Hey, shout out Just Kid, man. Have a good night, man. Have a great night. Hopefully we'll see you in some future streams. Probably gonna stream every day until I watch... Ant-Man. Today I was just gonna not even stream and just go play Hogwarts. I'm glad I streamed today. So this is why you always gotta, you know, second guess whether or not you're gonna do something today. It's like the person that just said they weren't gonna come to the stream today. That's why you always gonna be like, you know what, fuck it, I will do this. Now, I was just going to chill today, play some Hogwarts Legacy, maybe hop on some shit with my friends. But I was like, nah, let me, let me, let me stream some Stardew. I feel like grinding it out in the valley. I'm glad I get, did and none of this would have happened. Shout out Just Kid again. Bro, I've been wanting to get a haircut. I haven't gotten a haircut in like three or four months. It's going to be like one of, one of those long periods where I don't get a haircut. And, uh, the only reason I haven't gotten a haircut is because my barber only cuts like certain periods of time during the day. I think there's only one day where he like cuts hair late. And you know me. I, don't, I got a, like a fucking night owl schedule. I'm up all night and I'm asleep all day. That is my schedule. There's nothing surprising to it. That is my schedule. I still get annoyed when like I tell people when I wake up and they're like, what? It's like, bro, there, there's people that have you ever heard of a night job before? <laughs> like, I know I'm a YouTuber, but I'm a night person. I tried to become a day person. That shit just don't it don't fit me. I tried it. I've tried multiple times to fix my sleep schedule, but it always goes back to how it is. The only time I ever have, like, a regular sleep schedule is when I, like, go to the East Coast. 
because I don't got a choice. Yeah, like when, when my brother visited and my mom was telling him about my sleep schedule, he's like, yeah, that's normal. <laughs> he's like, he's a YouTuber, he, that's normal for him. And I see, I'm like, see, somebody fucking understands. Well, how does my mom not understand that I sleep late? Well, she, she understands now, but she still be telling people. Like, he sleeps late. I was like, yeah, I do that. That's my productivity. That's how I get things done. Late night. I think it's harder to maintain a good sleep schedule. Because it's, like, so easy to fuck up a sleep schedule. Like, you stay up late one night, boom. Sleep schedule fucked up. I could work forever to fix it. Work a whole, like, a week trying to fix it. And then I stay up late one night, boom. That shit, back to normal. That's why I kind of just, like, stop caring about trying to fix it. Because when I do fix it, it just goes back to how it was. Yeah, that makes sense. If you got, like, a job or a school, obviously, you need to maintain your sleep schedule. But also, you'll actually be, like, tired. I'm like me. You're like, I don't do too much. I'm not actively doing too much. Which, I want to get back in the gym. I, I had a nice little gym grind before I visited my brother. Had a nice little gym grind going on. But then, I got busy. I visited my brother. I visited my dad. Did not have time. And then I got sick, have the little cough that I have, and I'm waiting, that, waiting for that to go away fully. It's still there a little bit, which is annoying, because I'm trying to get back in there. But yeah, I feel like I need to, like, have, like... An active something going on for me to go to sleep. Because, like, sleeping, I feel like ever since I became, like, a, a full adult doing, like, adult shit, I feel like I've just, I just have trouble sleeping. Like, sleeping ain't the same for me anymore. It's a hassle. Hold on, I'm trying to make sure, like, I got room to, like, walk around here. Because I think we could set this shit up in a certain way. Like that. As long as we have an area to walk. There you go. And then I guess we could put some out here. No, don't do that. That's not how you fight something. <laughs> My body cannot go to sleep if I don't do any intensive work during the day. That's what I'm saying. Like, I remember a long time ago, like, when I worked at Target and Ross, like, that shit would actually make me tired. It's not that, like, I'm doing too much physical activity. Because I just stand behind a register all day when I worked at Ross. But, uh, it's like... I had to wake up early, I had to go walk to Ross, and then I had to work. And then I had to walk home back usually, unless my mom picks me up. Oh, hold up. Leo, that's his house. Welcome, Leo. Welcome to the family. The beautiful home of Stardew Valley. something damn i almost made 100k today look at this 4950 from three ancient fruit that's crazy that is crazy make some cash we almost had two million you missed one did i miss one oops 
I'll play one more day and then I think I'm gonna end stream. Cause I still got shit I need to do. But yeah, my mom, she's still in the Philippines visiting her mom. This is like my first time like really like living on my own. Like I'd be on my own, obviously. When my mom goes to work and shit. Like I've always been on my own in terms of like my mom being at her job for a while. Since I was like what like sixth grade, fifth grade out here. Ever since we got this apartment, like ten plus years ago. It's crazy that I've been living in the same apartment for ten years. But uh it's like it's weird having to do all the things. Cause usually my mom does a lot of things. Usually my mom does all the uh main chores that don't require muscle. You know, like bringing up the groceries, taking out the trash, shit like that. Like doing dishes, I don't do dishes. My mom doesn't. I barely even be using dishes. Or like cooking like big meals, like my mom does it. I don't do that. I should learn how to do it, really, I should. But my mom doesn't. She wants to do it. Me, I'm just, I told her, like, I'm I'm the money maker of the house. I pay majority of the rent. My mom only has to work a couple of days a week. She's, like, retired now because I allowed her to do that. So, like, me having to do everything, it's pretty crazy. Pretty surreal. Nice learning experience. Yeah, there you go. Exactly what you just said. Cam. But it does make me, like, realize, like, I should help around the house more. She is getting older. But like I said, like, I am the money maker of the house. I'd be considered the breadwinner of the family. Even though, you know, you with YouTube, shit goes up and down a lot. Like, like I said, right now, like, it got scary. It looked like I was barely going to be able to pay rent. Just because I had that, like, half of, half of December where I wasn't here posting videos. And you know how my viewers could be sometimes. No offense to you right now, but, like, how do I post a video with 350k viewer, 350k subs, and that shit gets 1,000, 2,000 views? Like, I love my viewers. You guys make it possible for me to do the job, but y'all motherfuckers don't watch my videos. <laughs> so forgive me for being, like, kind of fraudulent my viewers are, aren't they? But I understand it a little bit. Wow, I really don't have enough mayo machines. The fuck? Did I not harvest them for two days? I guess I didn't. Yeah, it's been kind of fun living on my own. It's kind of messy in the house. I ain't gonna lie to you. I moved a bunch of furniture around. <laughs> for me and the boys to hang out in the living room. And also me to hang out in the living room. I've been hanging out in the living room the whole entire, like, month. It was a fun experience. Do I have pets? No. I would definitely have a pet, though, if my apartment allowed it. Yeah, I've been hearing a dog barking in the apartment. I'm about to snitch. I ain't gonna lie to you. If I can't have a cat, then y'all can't have a dog in here. I'm not gonna lie. I'm about to snitch. <laughs> I'm about to tell that directly to the fucking... Where the fuck those people are called that own the apartments. Landlord, there you go. I'm like, yeah, I hear barking. And if I can't have a cat, then that motherfucker who's got a dog barking shouldn't have his dog. That's all I'm saying. I can't have my cat. You can't have your dog. Let's just have it be fair. What's, what's the inside of here looking like? Hmm. 
No, I'll harvest it. I'll harvest it. I gotta kill a slime in here. I gotta kill these green ones. How do I kill one slime, right? There you go. <gasps> My bad. <laughs> I can hit half of them with it. I didn't expect all of them to jump that direction. <laughs> Bro, I gotta remember, I gotta keep some milk and shit. All these eggs that I have, I'm about to keep. For uh, making food here. I'd be forgetting that I need some eggs and milk to make food, because... We gotta make more recipes. I'm trying to think, like this second half of Stardew, I, I I guess I'm gonna consider this the second half. But like when I get to this point of editing this on YouTube, like this second half of the series, where it's all like completion work, it's probably gonna be all like compiled into like one thing or some shit. Cause this like part is a grind. Like, there really ain't too much new shit going on. We get a couple new cutscenes here and there, but... Other than that, like, we really just grinding out the last half of this game. Hey, I finally managed to catch you. Sure, man, what's up? Snow mist. You caught us at the back end of the stream. We're gonna end after this Stardew Valley day, but... Glad you still caught up, man. We're gonna gift some gifts. That's probably where we're gonna spend the rest of the day doing. Gifting out gifts. The grind is the best part. I guess. What the fuck do I give Demetrius at this point? I've given him two pearls. I'll give him a prismatic shard. If he doesn't like me after that, I'm gonna be mad. Wizard, you're gonna get a dark essence today. Caroline, I don't have any of this. Fish taco? Like, do I have a fish taco? <laughs> I'm gifting out another gold pumpkin. No, I'm not. Diamond. No, I'm not. Pearl. She in the pearl. What am I doing with the pearls anyways? Marnie. She likes diamonds. Perfect. Robin. Peach. Elliot. Feather. Robin, Peach, Elliot, Feather. Got it. You trying to get perfection? That's the goal. But like, I don't know. We'll see. What, we'll see. How I'm, I'm just trying to play in the game. It, I feel like perfection is still so far away. Maybe I'll just try and complete all the stars. Peach? What does a peach look like? All right, we're going to the wizard first. Oh, I still, you know, hold on, hold on. I need to put some fish in this fucking, oh, fuck. The fish are going to ask for me to get something. I just need regular fish. No matter what the fish is. Sunfish, rainbow trout, sunfish. I just need some sort of fish to produce... Row. Not Stingray Row, though. We got Stingray Row. Pond is full. You know, I actually want to remove all the fish in return. Let's, let's do, uh. Oh, the fish turn regular? Okay, so the stars don't matter then. It's kind of interesting. Very interesting. Hey, do you like fish? 
Probably not, right? <laughs> you like what I'll dig up right here. Pre-store hand axe, you're welcome. I always be giving her the worst fucking gifts. I can't lie to you. She probably hates me. I could have gave her that flower. Ah, this is imbued with potent arcade energy. It's very useful for such things. The beloved farmer. There we go. That is like 10 people. Right? Where the fuck is that at? Here it is. Reach 10 heart with 8 people. Okay. Yeah, that's me. The beloved farmer. You know how it is. Visit Marnie. Hopefully, she's actually working. You know how it is. Best Stardew spouse. I've only been married to one. Well, I married Haley in another save. And then I think another other save, I was trying to marry Penny or Leia. Really? That wasn't enough? I fucking hate these NPCs. Uh, but best Stardew spouse, uh, Krobus. Oh, shit, speak about Krobus. I was supposed to give him something. You know what? He sells void eggs. I can just give that shit to him. Krobus, my guy. You buy it from him? You can buy multiple. Buy it from him? And then you give it back to him. <laughs> Now that's how you give Krobus shit. Look at that. Look how high up he is. Because it was a birthday. Wait, hold on. Speak about birthdays. Harvey. I think it's Harvey's birthday. Shit, hopefully I didn't miss it. I'm pretty sure it's Harvey's birthday. Caroline. Um, what do you like? Pearl. I think it's Harvey's birthday. Let's check. <laughs> I fucking missed it. No! Now I gotta actually work to get his hearts up. How high up? He's gotta be high up. I've been giving him gifts he loves. Where the fuck is he? Three? Because we were getting gifted subs from Just Kid. It had me distracted. Just Kid was blessing us. Oh, I already finished, finished the wizard. Man, I already finished these two. Alright, Demetrius is getting prismatic. Robin's getting this. Elliot's getting this. Maybe I'll just give it to Leo, actually. Because Leo is nearby. Wait, how high up is Leo? Not that high up at all. Yet, we still were able to finish this shit. Alright. That's a hot take. Harvey the best, in my opinion. No, Krobus is the best. There is no hot take. Fact, no fiction. You like skulls? You like fish? Wow, you're already maxed out. You like feathers. I've learned a lot from my parrot family, but I'm sure there's a lot more out there I don't know. Wait, what the fuck? Why is that still their dialogue? Why is that still their dialogue like Leah don't fucking live here now? Leo is literally a part of the valley. Or Pelican Town. Why is this... Why is this town just not called Stardew Valley? Why is it called... Pelican Town? You're trying to confuse people. You like Crocus? 
You like emeralds? You're welcome. Shit, I might as well visit the desert and give Sandy a crocus, right? Oh, fuck that. Never mind. I'm going to the night market. <laughs> the night market is my favorite event. Leia, you like crocus? Here you go. Because Mayor Lewis lost his virginity to a pelican. Interesting. Lupini. I'm trying to get some Lupini paintings. I wish I was old enough to see the mermaid show. It's not that interesting, believe me. It is not that interesting. Hey, we can do the submarine shit. I need to catch a squid in the submarine. Let me bring up the fishing. Midnight squid. On the submarine ride. That's it. <laughs> well, before I do that, let me go just talk to everybody. Then I'm gonna do with candy canes. Lupini, he got that new shit. Lupini. I'm selling this painting. Lupini, don't you know I'm your favorite? Your best fan. Not your favorite. You probably don't even know. You don't even know me for me, no. But I'm your biggest fan, Lupini. I love you. Whoa. 1200 for that? What you mean for that? You talking shit? Talk shit about my Lupini paintings now. Pink plush seat. I ain't buying that shit. Excuse me. Wait, hold on. Let me do the Stardew shit. Or the. Get the fuck out of the way! Let me do this first. What the fuck's the code? Do I get a new thing for this? I don't remember. Do you get a pearl every year? Is anybody know? No? Let me the fuck out of here. <laughs> I ain't got time for all that. But this music is also a banger, I can't lie. Alright, let's go fish. Take me under. Fishing in the deep blue sea. This takes a while to get down here, huh? Come on, give me the squid right away. Let's get this over with. Nice. <laughs> nice. The game heard me. They said, all right, we got you. Might as well listen to the music a little bit, you know? Let me know if I need more of these scary looking fish. Look this one right there. I honestly wish that Stardew had even more content. I feel like once you really like see all the content. 
like there really isn't too much once you get like a step back and look at it like as a new player there's a lot but then when you're ready to go back a second time it's like damn there actually really isn't that much I'm not saying it's not a fun game this game might have like the most replayability than like most modern games But that's what mods are for. Stardew Expanded. X Tardew. I wonder how crazy I can make the game with mods. Like in terms of just pure content. We about to make Stardew 2. That's gonna, that's gonna be the title of the first episode of the modded series. Stardew 2. That's enough. Get me out of here. There's a mod where you date George and Evelyn literally kills George. <laughs> it sounds like my kind of mod. All right, I'm in them. You know what it is. Got to go make sure I go sell all the eggs and shit. Gonna hang up this lupini in here. Is a Stardew like game coming out this year? Is that the game I always be seeing on fucking Twitter? That literally looks exactly like Stardew. Like, I thought it was a Stardew texture pack. Still looks cool, though. I'd probably play it. I still want to play, uh... What's it called? You know what? Here, keep two of each of these. I still want to play, uh, Graveyard Keeper. That is a game I've been wanting to play. You still play Terraria? No. Hate it. One of the Terraria devs called me the hard R. They said Game Raider instead of Game Raider. Hold up. I'm replacing the furnace. We got an Iridium one. Yeah. Major upgrade, baby. Got a frog statue. Put this in the corner. Dead, bro. He lives. Tupac probably would be a Terraria slash Stardew fan. Mr. Shakur. All right. I think we end it off here. Call it a night. Had some fun. Good stream. Tupac would be a game where there's enjoy effects. We will continue the grind tomorrow, maybe. maybe we'll play some Terraria. Maybe I'll play with my balls. I don't know. We'll see. You never know what can happen. Speak about Twitch paying me. I just got paid today. Shout out Twitch. If you guys want to know how much, it was fifty dollars. You want to know the exact amount? Fifty-two dollars and thirty-eight cents. That's you guys. Shout out to you guys. You guys just put fifty-two dollars and thirty-eight cents. <laughs> all right. I'll see y'all tomorrow. What's tomorrow? Wednesday.
Yeah. Thursday, though, I'm going to watch Ant-Man. But that's not until 9 p.m. So, yeah, I might be able to stream. I might be able to stream Thursday. We'll see. We watching Ant Man though at like nine ten. I'm hyped as fuck for Ant Man. I can't lie to you. It's been a minute since I seen an MCU movie. Yeah, see y'all.